Lena Taylor jumped into the race late after first running for lieutenant governor, and tonight she tells Fox 6 she has called Johnson and Donovan to congratulate them both on tonight's results. Sam Kramer live at her election watch party. And Sam, what did Lena Taylor have to say? Yeah, hi there, Mary. We spoke with her within the last 20 minutes or so, and she says she's comfortable with the campaign she ran, saying she spent about $2 per vote received tonight, but she fears that Milwaukee is headed toward a status quo with Johnson and Donovan moving forward. She didn't offer any sort of endorsement for either candidate, but she did offer some ideas as far as what they could target leading up to that election and then for whoever wins that election, mainly two issues. First, public safety addressing the rising homicide rate within the city and second, the looming pension crisis at City Hall. What I know is that we're going to be close to bankruptcy and I think we have to be honest with the people of where we are and they're going to have to bring in new revenue and there's no question about that. And as a resident, I'm going to be here pressing for things to be better because things can be. You heard in that sound by as a resident. She says she looks forward to being a constituent here, but let's not forget she is still a state senator representing District 4 in Wisconsin. She looks forward to continuing that work in, the, in Madison. For our live tonight in Milwaukee, Sam Kramer, Fox 6 News. All right, Sam, thank you.